All right, like comparing it to art, right? Like we said, like there's some artists, you know what I'm saying, they, they come out and they get commissioned right away and they, they know what they're doing. However, they haven't, they haven't seen or experienced the same history and culture as somebody who might have been working on their art, which is just as good visually to see, you know, who might be on the street selling their art for like five bucks, like for example, like Basquiat and Andy Warhol. If, if Basquiat hadn't met Andy Warhol, nobody would know who the fuck Basquiat was. But the same is true with, with hip hop culture and like a lot of these kids, you know, good good people get put on through who they know or what they've done, you know what I'm saying, in front of other people. Whereas like, you know, a lot of artists like ourselves are still putting out just as good quality of art, but it's, um it's not getting seen like like you would see it in the mainstream and then our gripe with that is that like a lot of the people in the mainstream haven't taken on the appropriate channels or haven't learned the history of the culture and are exploiting the history of the culture without knowing their past or the roots of like what we've been through because hip-hop is not like it's not like any other genre like there's i mean there's a there's a history to every other genre but like for hip hop, I mean, similar to the 60s rock and roll, the people have died for this culture. People have shed blood so that we could be here today and do what we do. You know what I mean? A lot of people don't understand that. It's, it's like, you can't just step in, 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 in a room, record a rap and be a rap star and not know, you know, the, the, the essence, the essence and, and the, the reason that you're allowed to do that, you're able to do that or the, or the people that made it possible for you to do that and that that kind of business me off.